G'day guys, Greg here. Well, here I am at Burley Heads, and today I'm gonna to go to Pie Pie. Now, I've been driving past this shop for years, but I've never stopped in to try a Pie Pie. So how about we rip on into Pie Pie and try a Pie Pie Pie? <laughs> Let's do it. Alright, well here we have it, the Pie Pie. Now this Pie Pie costs $8 and you can get a side added for a few extra dollars. So 12 bucks you can get a meal like this. Now they had a whole variety of different pies, but the pie I got today was the Danny Dorito. Now the Danny Dorito is filled with a slow braised taco beef brisket, nacho cheese sauce and black beans topped with guacamole and Mexican corn chips. And I decided to get the mushy peas side. I could have got like uh, mashed potatoes or like uh, mac and cheese or some other things as well. But anyway, let's suss out what this pie's like. Now, I was talking to the owner, I think it was the owner or just an employee, he said that uh, they're all chefs that work there and they're made on site. And well, it just looks really good. Have a look at this pastry. Man, that's light and fluffy. Yeah. Let's see if we can suss out what this filling might be like. Well, there's some cheese involved there. And you can see the beans and everything. So I'm guessing it's going to be a real Mexican-y flavor, this one. Mmm. How about I start off with some of these mushy peas? Mmm. They're not as sweet as those ones at Goldstein's. They're a real sort of pea taste. A little bit more rustic tasting. Mmm. Now this pastry looked really good. Mm. Light, fluffy, pretty nice. Mm. Crunchy as well. Now it's got these Doritos and in the top here it's got a guacamole. Holy guacamole! Mmm. Oh that's nice. Oh. Mmm. That's like three meals in one. Mmm. Oh, that's good. Very easy to eat. Mmm. All right, well. Oh, have a look at the crust on that. Wow. That looks really nice. Looks beautifully cooked all the way through. And it's quite a decent depth. Mmm. Mmm. Wow. That has got some really good Mexican flavors. You can really taste that, like those beans and that meat is really nice. It's quite salty, but I think sometimes that's just what you need. It's got a real authentic Mexican-y sort of flavor and it has got a little bit of kick to it. A bit of spice that just tickles the back of your throat. But it's really nice. It's almost like an Aussie taco. Yeah. Mmm. Mmm. Oh. Mmm. And here's some of the brisket. Well, beef. Yum. Oh, yeah. Really nice, really tender, melt in your mouth. That is a really good pie. It could be right up there with one of the best ones I've ever had. The pastry is really nice. The filling is really delicious. Like everything on this just tastes so good. And man, I just want to keep eating it. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Oh. Mmm. Yeah. And once I got a bit of that guacamole mixed in with it, oh wow. <laughs> it just took it to another level. 
I was going to go the Baker's Original because that's your standard meat pie, but I went the exotic one. And now, mate, I just want to go back and try their whole list of pies. They got so many different pies in there. They got like Thai ones and a farmer's one with veggies and oh, your stock standard meats, but they also do jaffles and like healthy salad bowls as well, coffee and. Mate, it's a, it's a one-stop shop for all your Aussie tucker. And these exotic pies are really good. I'm really enjoying it. I'll definitely go back and get another one, that's for sure. Now, Pie Pie has got a 4.8 Google Star rating. And, well, I reckon that's spot on. It's a really top quality product and it tastes really good. So there you go, the Pie Pie. I'm asking myself now why I haven't stopped there before. <laughs> I'll definitely stop there again. And if you go there... Tell them Greg sent you. I'm pretty sure they'll have a clue. Anyway, I'm gonna sit here and watch the wind blow through the leaves of the trees. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time I try a pie. See you then. Oh yeah, this is Greg's kitchen where the reviews are finger.